Hello out there, David Wids Electric here, catching the last bit of sunlight for today, uh, just in time, because I'm um, meeting with the client tomorrow morning, and uh, we're going to hand off uh, what we've been calling the Z-Bug 2. This is uh, our updated version of our uh, electric bug, and I'm really proud of this. This time around, we have uh, Tesla batteries in the Beetle, about a 100 mile plus range, depending on how heavy your foot is. Uh, we have a two-speed transmission, and uh, let's see, just two forward gears. Uh, it's actually in the, the higher gear right now. We're just cruising around at 25 miles an hour, uh, but around town, it's fine. Uh, if you want to get off the line quicker, put it in the first gear, take that up to about 45. We have a very minimalist dash here. It's a 1960 in black and uh, there's no gas gauge. The only uh, instrument on the, uh, the dash is the speedometer. So we're running out of light here so I'm going to follow up in uh, narrator mode. Hopefully you can hear me better there too. Okay. It's just our little pedestrian warning device. It's a little electric trolley bell just to let people know that we're coming in all those quiet places like parking lots. Um, so let me think, what did I leave out? Uh, well, the newest addition to the Z-Bug 2 is the Tesla batteries. Uh, we now have a custom battery management system as well from our friends at EV West. Um, new battery boxes, super exciting, in black aluminum. Um, a lot of black on this car, including a black powder-coated motor and uh, black component panels in the motor bay. This motor has a little more horsepower than before. It's about 100 now. And uh, we also relocated some of the components back here for a cleaner look. We have some changes up front. Uh, let's see, we replaced the stock beam with an adjustable one. Uh, now that the car is a couple hundred pounds lighter, thanks to the Tesla batteries, we can use this uh, adjustable beam to dial in the correct ride height. I like it about one, one and a half inches lower than stock. Um, also, new steering components, disc brakes, dual master cylinder, gas shocks, sway bars, and we even put a camber compensator in the back. Everything's converted to 12 volt. We have seven inch LED headlamps up front from truck light, and then all the rest are from super bright LED, uh, dot com. Uh, except for the tail lamps, those are from Chip Burke, and I like to use his uh, LED lights on the older Beetles to you know get that snowflake uh, light pattern. Uh, super bright. And then you also have a secure hardwire connection back there. Let's peek inside. Everything looks really proper. We have a sapphire radio that works. Uh, no gas gauge, which is appropriate for this year. Um, and there's just you know a few knobs on the dash. The shifter looks period, but uh, it's not. It's a brand new short throw shifter from Vintage Speed. And it's just wonderfully precise and total overkill uh, for this car because we only have two speeds. This time we re-geared a standard transaxle with just two forward gears um, just to get the most power from, from the motor. There's a switch on the dash for reverse, so parallel parking, a manual on a hill, it's just super easy this way. We hid uh, our digital fuel gauge in a USB charge port in the glove box. The, our client really wanted to keep this car very simple looking. Uh, so there's no stereo here, no heater, um, just an AM radio. We, we did add a variable switch for the wipers. And um, then there's a switch to adjust the regen on the fly too, giving the, uh, the driver a little bit more control. There's also a regen sensor in the brake line so stopping this car is super quick super responsive 
I think that's about it. Um, like all of our cars, you can plug it in anywhere at home or public chargers. All right. Follow us on Twitter or Instagram, Facebook for all the day-to-day fun. Um, you can also email me if you have any questions, david at zelectric.com. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and select that little bell icon so you'll get updated when we post a new video. Thanks a lot for watching and happy motoring.